Hello everyone, my name is Wang Liang, the Aragon watch designer, and welcome to our Aragon watch presentation. This is the first watch we're introducing in year 2023. And I picked this one is because this is something new that we have never done before. It's all about the dial. The dial is out of this world, okay? So we, this collection, you might have seen before, which is the Aragon DF47. Probably like a year or two years ago, we first debuted this. But now this time, we're presenting to you with a brand new dial. And not only this dial, also, um, you know, the case is 47 millimeter from three or nine o'clock position, K1 crystal, SII NH35 automatic, and the water resistance of this watch is 300 meters, okay? Uh, or 990 feet. So presenting to you with the silver strap, but you can also upgrade it to a uh, stainless steel mesh bracelet, which is, I have, I have this here uh, next to the watch. Uh, the lux size is 24 millimeter. Okay, so let's come in and I hope you like this watch. I hope you like how we come up with this dial and when you see a close up of the dial, you will be mesmerized by how it looks. All right, let's come in. Okay, as we can see the close up of this watch. So what we have, the brand new DF47, right? So as you know, 47 stands from the case, the case size from nine to three o'clock, okay? So there's a little bit different for this case because the case is not completely, um, the case is extended outside of the bezel. So it wears very well on the wrist, okay? And from this side, let me bring it up. Okay, so you can see the case construction, the design is slightly different than what we usually do, you know, like a uh, round case. So that's why this is called a DF-47. D stands for depth, F stands for fighter. Um, so these are the four colors as we're presenting right now. And let me try to get a closer look. Look at this. The dial is absolutely insane out of this world. Uh, let me talk about the four colors first, and then I start talking about the detail, how we made this dial. It's the first time we've ever made a dial like this. Um, the first one right here, we call it the yellow. The second one, again, we call it the teal. You know what I'm talking about. It's the uh, Robin X Pantone, exactly like the Dive Master 42. We're using this Pantone very frequently right now because we have a lot of, uh, it's quite popular. We have a lot of people liking this, look at that. And then the third is the orange. Wow. Trying to tilt it every angle where you can see the light reflection. And then the last, we have the real pure red wow so some of you may have seen the df47 case from uh, a couple years ago and this is the new updated version the new dial version so let's talk about how we made this dial so firstly when you uh, let me pick up the yellow because the yellow is very easy to see under these studio lights. So how we did this style is first we created the texture. The texture is a random texture. Is there's not uh, and, and there's not they're not like uniform. So it was created by taking this metal dial, stamping them, right? When you get this watch at home, if you can look at it closely, you see this fabulous texture. But at the same time, if I can find this angle, it is also flat. How this is being done is we pour enamel on top of it and naturally levelized. OK, 
Okay, this is the first time we've created this. So when I receive the prototype of the dial, okay, and the result didn't come out this good, and I was thinking, what can I, it was actually my idea. And I said to uh, my t our technical manager, I said, what can we do to make this dial even more vibrant? And I thought of, why don't we pour levelizing enamel on top of this metal texture? So what we did is, firstly, we stamped the texture randomly. We spray painted. Okay, we spray painted. Of course, you know, we have to uh, mix our own color first. After we spray it dried. And then we pour the levelizing enamel coating on top of this. And the result just came out like this. Is this the closest I can bring it to the camera? This is insane. If you're going to get this watch, okay, and you're, you're a watch enthusiast, you probably have a lot of watches. I'm not so sure if you have a dial similar to this in your collection. Very vibrant. So the yellow, the teal, the orange are much easier to see because they are a lighter color. Okay, so I want you, I want to be um, for it. So I don't want anybody to be disappointed when they receive it and say, oh, I got the red. I can't see it as the texture as clear as the others. Okay. The whole idea of this brand new DF47 is all about the dial. So the case, let's talk about the case. And later on, I'm going to put on my wrist and show it to you. So let's talk about the case. The case is three to now clock position has, uh, is the 47 millimeter. The bezel is approximately 45. Okay. And you have the teeth on the outside for gripping 120 teeth. Okay. Very precise. All right. Let me turn it back to the center because I know a lot of you really enjoy seeing the bezel in the middle, in the center position. All right. And then there's a lot of angles to create this watched case design. It's like almost like an airplane, like a jet fighter. Okay, that was the whole idea. Vertical, vertical polishing for the surface. The side is high mirror polished finish. Okay, not sure if you can see it. Okay, and then for the bezel, what we have done is the numbers and the minute indicators are all raised. Like a coin, right? You can see that. And then the fill it with black ink all around the bezel to create this dual tone. Now the lug area, okay, is a hidden lug. So when you wear this watch, you can see how, you know, how usually, um, you know, with the round case or some of the, our, you know, the arrogant watch design, we expose the lug area. But this one, when you wear it, you don't see it, okay? Crown is somewhat recessed into the case, which is very, very cool. All right, let me put this down again. Let me show you the next color. Oh, just kicked the camera by accident. Look at that. I think the teal, the yellow, and the orange came out like you can see the texture. Wow. All right, fully decorated rotor with the Aragon blue. The movement is SII NH35. Make sure it's a screw down crown, right? So when, because it has a hidden lug, it also has a hidden crown protector. So sometimes we might miss locking the crown after we uh, adjust it. So make sure you lock and push and turn at the same time. Water resistance, you can go scuba diving with this watch. 
All right, so I have a mesh bracelet with this. So I just want to show it to you what it looks like. I think it looks even better with a mesh bracelet. But we're presenting this with the silicone strap. Very soft. It's a very, very soft silicone strap. Okay, and it's very easy if you want to do this, you know, do this at home. I know a lot of you guys really enjoy modifying your watches. Okay, don't ask me. All four colors are my favorite, and I just absolutely think it's insane. Um, you're going to see a lot more of this dial coming in 2023. I got to show more of the red because I know recently with our red dial watches are very, very popular. Let me see how close I can get. Wow. So these are white loom, right? White loom glows green, I believe. I didn't check it. Okay, so, and uh, let me show you the orange. I just want to show you the dial. This is the reason why this new collection is all about the dial. It's all about the dial. All right, so I think I cover everything about the DF47. So let me let me go back and do it one more time about the specs is uh, the case diameter from three to nine is 47 millimeter k k1 crystal sii nx35 automatic silicone strap but you can upgrade it to the stainless steel mesh bracelet okay and we only have four dial colors as of right now Okay, and then the rotating bezel is 120 teeth. All right, so I'm gonna put this on. And by the way, oh, let me take off my personal watch first. By the way, I'm loving it. This is the D, um, the Dive Master 42 with the Ronda R150. Okay, so I put on my glove. I'm gonna put on the watch so you can see what it looks like. I'm gonna go slowly so where you can see some action of this watch. Got some light reflection into the dial where you can see it. Okay, so this is the teal, the yellow. Sorry. Get some light into the yellow dial. So at the end of the video, we're going to show you about five to 10 seconds of the loom shot. So you can see is the white loom glows green. Got it. I'm going to do the red next because we got to give more love to the red. And the last is the orange. Okay, guys, so thanks so much for tuning in and watch our Aragon watch presentation and help us because we are a small brand and help share our video, spread the words about our brand so more people will know who we are. And uh, I will see you next next time. And uh, happy New Year to everyone. Um, this is January twenty twenty three.